JC ID Battery Health Quick Repair Board Q1 Standard package with a total of 11 battery extension FPCs of 11 to 15 pm Single mode Let's take this Apple 15 as reference The health capacity of the transplanted battery is 93% Turn off the mobile phone Take out the transplanted battery Locate on the corresponding battery socket of quick repair board. Connect the output port of the corresponding battery extension FPC to the battery socket of mobile phone. Press the health minus signs to decrease battery health value. Press the health plus signs to increase battery health value. Press the cycle minus signs to decrease battery cycle counts. Press the cycle plus signs to increase battery cycle counts. The remaining battery life is displayed here. Let's adjust health value to 100 and cycle counts to 0. Press confirm to rise. When the light is on, it means that data writing succeeds and voltage output. Then boot up the phone. There will be a pop-up window when the phone is booted up for the first time after battery data is modified. Only need to restart the phone once. There is still a very high chance that data can be modified successfully the first time without pop-up window. No need for restarting. Turn off the phone and install the battery. Boot up the phone to check battery health again. Battery health is repaired successfully. Batch mode. Let's use this Apple C3 for demonstration. Shut down the phone. Buckle the transplanted battery on the corresponding battery socket of quick repair board. Use common power cords with data pins on the market to connect the output interface of USB cable to the battery socket of mobile phone. Long press confirm button to switch to batch mode. After setting up the parameters, press confirm button to write. After writing is completed, buckle another battery on the battery socket. As it can be seen, health and cycle set by users is saved in batch mode. Just replace the battery and click write to write data in batches. USB interface. USB interface is compatible with common power cords on the market. Measure the positive and negative poles of power cords with multimeter according to the markings. G and D negative pole is measured first. The yellow wire represents negative pole. For point to volts, positive pole is measured later. The red wire is positive pole. Measure SDA and SCL according to the markings. SDA is measured first. The green one represents SDA. SCL is measured later. The blue one represents SCL. After the channels are confirmed, power supply FPC can be soldered. Solder the corresponding channels on the power supply FPC with soldering iron. The DM power supply FPC corresponds to SDA. The CM power supply FPC corresponds to SCL. Testing it after soldering. Let's test with this IP15. Take out the power supply and buckle it on corresponding socket of quick repair board. Then connect the soldered power supply FPC to battery socket of mobile phone. Boot up the phone. Unlock the phone to check whether battery health value displays normally or not. Battery health value displays normally. The power supply FPC of USB interface is soldered successfully. Remote upgrade. Connect battery quick repair board to computer with a USB cable. Open JC ID repair platform on the computer. Log in. Please notice whether the corresponding driver of the quick repair board is downloaded or not. Click repair fitting. The device system will be upgraded automatically. Upgrade is successful. Which can prevent new problems caused by iOS upgrade. Modify battery health under iOS 17.4 system. Let's use this iPhone 15 for demonstration. Take apart the battery and buckle it on corresponding socket of quick repair board. Connect the output port to battery socket of the phone with the corresponding battery extension FPC or a common USB cable. Set up health value and cycle counts that need to be modified. Click confirm. Connect mobile phone to computer with the USB cable afterwards. Open the third party platform on the computer. Click smart flash. Select regular flash. Start flashing right now.
pay attention to TIG repair battery health issues during flashing. Take according the reference picture on other platforms. So confirm the flash. Flashing is completed. Unlock the phone to check battery health value afterwards. Battery is repaired. Repair battery health under iOS 17.4 system is finished.